Welcome back. Let's play some 10 minute games here on Shogi Wars. Should take a second to load. We'll just redo the intro. Welcome back. Let's play some 10 minute games here on Shogi Wars. I think I'll go back to playing third file Rook. It'd be nice to, I don't know. Yeah, my last game I lost in somewhat embarrassing fashion, so we'll try not to repeat that mistake. I did want to play Central File Rook more often, but Third File seems to be good luck. It seems to be what takes in the points, since that's the one I seem to understand the best. I could be mistaken. Um, hmm. All right. Let's close this diagonal. Perhaps. No, this is fine. There it is. Third file rip. No indecision there. And we bring this up, and this threatens to hit that, but never actually moves all the way up that way. The opponent's king has moved, so let's move our king a bit. And this looks fine. This might provoke the opponent to push their edge pawn. I didn't expect it to provoke them to go into this, but apparently that's what it's done. So that's fine. They've built the corner castle, and we'll try to make this work. Um, this file is always instrumental in attacking that castle, so I start to open this up. Uh, this is weak at the corner, at the edge, and not really anywhere else. Um, Mm hmm. Interesting. Is that playable? All right, let's try this. I thought this was fine for me. I'm threatening. Oh wait, this isn't a promotion threat. Oops. Uh, I had a plan. The plan is no good, but I had a plan. All right, let's find a plan B before it's too late. Um, yeah. Plan B. Here we go. Not backing down without a fight here, which seems more than a bit insane given how prepared my opponent is for the situation and how underprepared I am, but, you know, it is what it is. All right, so this bishop retreats. This actually traps my knight. So... Mm-hmm. Hmm... <laughs> mm. Yeah, if you could feel pain, this would hurt. Uh, if I can feel pain, this will start to hurt. So we're just not going to feel pain then. And it'll be okay. So we're threatening to promote the bishop. I really don't know if I have a second threat, but I need to have one. Um, hmm. All right, I'll try to use the silver somehow. This isn't crazy. You're crazy. No, I'm just joking. But um, let's see. Probably can't ignore everything. Mm 
Hmm. Okay, so the opponent is offering a gold general. Hang on. Hold the phone. This bishop is beautifully placed. Um, and I continue my forward progress. Okay. That's a pin. Hmm. Once we stop laughing, we start crying. So let's keep this dance going. My silver will dance and hit the bishop again. This bishop, I, I like that I've displaced this gold. I forced my opponent to do something they didn't want to do. Um, as for who that benefits, I don't know. But, like... Hmm... Oh, this point is weak. Oh, that's no good. Um... That's smart, right? Oh, nothing can possibly go wrong here. Nanafun. All right, here we go. Western style attack. All right, what's going on? Um. Okay, I'm not gonna let that pawn promote. All kinds of forks and stuff. This is fine. I don't know. Is there something wrong here? What could possibly be wrong with this position? An ascending king is actually somewhat challenging to deal with. Um, if you've seen games where I've lost because my opponents made it my opponent's king made its way up the board. You'll know that ascending kings um, are not the easiest challenge. Oh, well, cool. That's beautiful. All right. That is beautiful. Yeah, okay, we'll concede this. Well played. Oops. All right, one down, two to go, one to go. I don't think we're gonna, <laughs> Destiny wins again. Could be. Yeah. <sighs> I did get to play third file rook that game though. Let it be noted that I played third file rook like I said I was gonna do. Good luck. Oh fun. Let's let's do this. Here we go. I wasn't feeling very fall rook anyway. Yeah. This is fun. Whoa, okay, this is a little too much fun. Uh what the hell? Why would you do that? Okay. Or Q. I see. Do those numbers mean anything? Um, now they're aiming at this square clearly, but um, mm-hmm. I'm aiming at this square too. Both of us can aim at the square, and we'll see who gets it. How about that? Uh, you're saying the red reading category... Oh, okay. Well, check. Okay. Not check. Okay. I see. 
But yeah, I think you're talking generically about based on this rating, this player plays like, and then you're naming a persona. Um, all right. Do you want a lance? You can have a lance. It costs you a bishop. They wanted a lance. I know not why, but they did want it and they got it. Okay, maybe this has something to do with why they wanted it. Um, do you want a silver? You can have it. Okay. Uh, let's not offer the king. Tempting as that idea is. Yeah, we'll use the rook. <laughs> yeah, but who becomes the assigner of names? Possibly bishop takes silver is not the best move. At this point, I don't care. Um, I'm quite content to just take this. Okay, you can have my knight. I'm just being so generous today. Hmm? Something happened this game. Mm-hmm. All right, so um, there are too many good moves here. Thanks for the All right, two down, one to go. It's not easy playing depending on the hour of day or night. Uh, you can see on the right of the screen what time it is. Good luck. Third foul rook, here we go. Third foul rook never fails except when it does. Yeah, I was surprised to see this pairing too. Uh, okay, we'll push over here. That's a reasonable response. Hmm. Okay. We have time for this? How do we have time for this? This is how we have time for this? Okay. If you say so. I mean, it could be worse. If the silver moves up, I push my pawn, and maybe I get some tactics. Actually, I could exchange bishops here, can't I? Um, what the hell is this position? Okay, let's first open my rook, because that sounds like a good thing in prep. 
principle. Maybe a bishop exchange might have been smarter, but it is kind of nice leaving this lance and knight just back there. Um, so now we have this invasion point, or foothold, or whatever you call it. This pawn cannot be removed. I don't know how to play this sort of position. Hmm. All right. We're going to exchange this, even though I'm very confused. Um, If we could lure these silvers away from their current positions, I'd know either to attack this more fiercely or to be less concerned about this defense. So if they drop a bishop here, we exchange bishops. They drop a bishop where I can eat... well, it defends the knight. Uh, but I can oppose this bishop with my silver. Okay, that saves the lance. Sure. Um, Nana Fung. Here we go. Push, push, push. Bishop, bishop. Sack. It only takes six turns. So we start our countdown. Six. Five to go. Maybe we should start counting five. Four, three. Okay, never mind. They block my attack. Um, five, yeah, maybe six, maybe five, I, I'm not sure what the count is. Um, but also I might bring the bishop up here anyway, and then just take this and drop it there, or something. Okay, this threatens to open this file. I stop being snarky and start thinking that's actually a threat. Um, all right, I'm going to block my bishop for one instant so they can unblock it the next instant. Do I just take this? Pawn, knight. Oh, it's a mess. Um,
Well, that's cool. This is horrible. This is so horrible. Um, now we know. Go fun. I'm surprised they did rook takes. It might not matter though. Move first, read later. That's a proverb, right? <sighs> well, this is not great. Oh. Uh-oh. I thought I was surviving this, maybe. Um, it's not even close. Hmm. Hmm. I guess there might be something to review. Oh, they have lots of generals. I thought I was going to be able to just take this. And... No, taking doesn't help. Running is actually... It, it seems slightly better than taking. Um... We'll let the Tudon put on the fireworks show for us. Okay. Let's keep running. Oh. Oh, that's beautiful. All right, show us the mate. Thanks for the game. Well played. Well, that's three games for the day. I think three is enough. We had some fierce competition, and I did not rise to the challenge. But you never know. If I ever study my end games, maybe we'll see better games in the future. Thanks for watching. Have a good day.